Hello, everybody. This is Jake, your resident content cowboy here. Yeehaw! And I'm back with some more chess. Who do I want to take here? I don't even know. Stone Spirit. You get no love, Stone Spirit, so I'm putting you on the board. I'm back, and today I want to do a video about some dragons. You know, I was talking about some dragons in my most recent uh, top 10 most hated units video, and I recognize that I don't use them too often. So, I wanted to make a dragon video here. We're going for five dragon. That's my plan, at least. You know, get a couple wizards in there, maybe. Yeah, who knows? Maybe Dragon Knight will be our carry. The world is our oyster, and the sky is the limit. Did I say yeehaw? I realize I've not been yeehawing enough lately, and I understand how that can stress everyone out. Get out of here, buddy. We're going max now. Okay, so, five dragon. What do you get from going five dragon? Well, you're able to give mana to lots of people, full mana at the start of the encounter to six people on the board, I wanna say. And it's a pretty good ability. You know, normally it's used with mages, but I might even try using it with something else just because I feel like that's a pretty uh, tried and true strategy. It makes total sense. I mean, giving a whole bunch of mana right away to someone like uh, Tortilla Elder, yeah, you're gonna do a lot of damage like that. It's gonna be great. Let's see, hey, we got Ripper here. Nice little start, I'll grab a dragon, but I probably won't hold on to him. This is nice, just gives you a three mech start. I love starting with three mechs. I mean, that's excellent. If you can get on a little win streak, you get a bunch of free rolls. Gotta love starting with three mechs, especially if we have the opportunity to two star any of them, then you're in a really good spot. Really, really good spot. So let's see what happens here. Basically, every time you win with these three mechs, you just get a free roll because you get that heart of mech. I mean, it's not even basically. It's exactly what happens. <laughs> it's not basic, Jake. It's just the truth. All right. Let's see. I will take a Magicka Staff because I'm going to need that later. I will also take... What else am I going to need later? I could use some Cattle Hide Armor. I could use a Life Crystal. All of that's pretty important. I'll take this cattle hide armor. Skybreaker. I'm gonna roll. Oof. Mm, do I do it once more? Yeah. No dice. Didn't get what I wanted. That's okay. I could still probably win the round. I could have rolled once more, but then I'd have to sell something if I wanted to star up most likely, so. The only reason for rolling there is if I can two-star one of these people early, I have a chance of going on a win streak. That just, you know, I really benefit from that uh, heart of mech, so it's kind of the way to go if you can make it happen. <clears throat> just ride that wave, baby. As far as this last item, I could take either the cattle hide armor or the life crystal. I think it's going to be the life crystal, though, so I'll just take it. Who cares? All right, let's see. A goblin. Let's roll. A dragon. I don't need you now, though. Wow. Nobody. That's unfortunate. Well, I'm going to sell. I'm going to level. Get another one of these guys out on the board. And then you as well. I was hoping to find one of these two units. It's I feel like it's really unlikely that I didn't find either of them, but here we are. I'm going to do it again next round. I'm not quitting. Got to put this item on somebody. I'll probably give it... I'll actually give it to my... Well, I kind of want it on my tank. My Ripper tank. If one of them stars up... I'll move on, especially if it's Heaven Bomber. I mean, if Heaven Bomber stars, we're in a really good spot. Soul Breaker again. Our Golly Knight actually could be useful for me. Jeez. Whole lot of nothing, huh? There's Heaven Bomber, finally. Okay. I'll put our Golly Knight out there. Golly Knight's a pretty darn good unit. Maybe I'll put the armor on our Golly Knight just so he has a little extra time to cast, huh? Okay, so here we are. 
We've got a two-star Heaven Bomber, and now I'm going to be saving some money here. I'm probably going to win some of my rounds coming up here. doesn't mean I'm going to win all of them, but I'll probably win them. Okay. Looking pretty good. We got a... Hey, there we go. Not too bad. I'll grab a Flame Wizard just for a sec. So I can put someone else down here. I would love to grab another human right now. But we'll see if we find it next round. That way I could have mech human. That's just a really, I mean, a good early mech human. You know, it gives you all those free rolls. It gives you extra experience. It's just a great way to start the match. Two two-star units. I probably can do something like that. Actually have most of the damage to the two-star unit first before it gets to our golly knight. We'll see. See how it goes here. I've been having trouble finding games lately. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but the higher you get in rank, again, I'm not very high. I'm just in Rook or whatever, but boy, it's a lot harder to find games. It's a bummer. I say put me in a lower rank. I do dumb stuff all the time. And everyone agrees. <laughs> everyone online thinks so. I could level up here, but I'll just use the money. I'll just hold on. Gain a little interest. We're, I mean, it's likely we'll win any encounter. If there was a human here, like a source that cost one, and I could level up and put a third human on the board, I would definitely do that. Again, when I'm, when I'm winning, I like to win. And when I'm losing, I like to lose. I don't like to be somewhere in between. I think it's pretty, it's not a fun place to be. It's either I'm winning or I'm losing, baby. All right, let's see here. Goodbye, source. On a nice little win streak here. Let's see what this round gives us. We're definitely going to want to level and put someone out this next round. I'm not sure who it's going to be yet. No human, huh? Let me, let me roll. I'd like a human. Our golly knight. What? Hey, Avenge Knight. There we go. That's what I would like. That's what I'm talking about, game. So, my thought here is I've got three humans, two of them being knights, and I've got three mechs, three of them being goblins. So, we're taking advantage of a few synergies and we're greatly benefiting from these synergies if we win the round. If we win the round and a human survives, we get extra experience. If we win the round and a mech survives, we get extra rolls. All of it's extremely beneficial and it helps us just put the foot on the gas there. You can see the experience book and heart of mech right there. I'm going to take the books of experience. Oh my goodness. Dragon Knight? Right now? Are you serious? You cute, cute boy. Oh, welcome to the squad. Um, I could put you out instead of you, actually. If I level, I can get more of this other. Wow, Dragon Knight already? You gotta love that. What a world. I mean, that's who we're looking for. Ah, I love that. <laughs> that's great. I mean, this is just really, really positive for us. So good. Dragon Knight here in round 10. What are the odds? I actually don't even know. Well, what were the odds? 7%. We had a 7% chance of finding a tier 4 unit, and then there are all those tier 4 units. So, yeah, it was pretty unlikely, and it happened. Uh, out of all this, I could take Lucky Coin. I could take Magic of Crystal. Magic of Crystal helps us transform. You also could put a teleport dagger on him. Um, the lucky coin, I feel like, I mean, we've already got the armor. I'm just going to use it for the armor. That's what I wanted it for anyway. I'm not sure which one I want to take here. Maybe the crystal, maybe the other lucky coin, and we double that up. Let's take the crystal. For now, I'm just going to put it on our little sniper back there. Okay. Great. 
We're going to level soon. Hope we win this encounter. And then once we level, it's going to be time to keep putting that foot on the gas, baby. Get another knight out there, so we're going to be rocking four knight, which is a pretty good setup. All right. And we don't have any humans here, do we? We could get, we could transition this through to six human. It's just tough dropping two two-star mechs anytime soon, but we could move this through to six human. There's Ripper. There's another human. There's another dragon. Okay. I got 20 gold. I'm on a seven round win streak. Eat these books of experience. What's this cost? It costs 11 to level. I'm just doing it. I'm doing it. I'm putting out another night. I just want to push hard towards winning here. That's my thought. Make it harder and harder and harder to lose. And more units on the board, you know, completing better synergies. It puts us in that position. Human wise, we've got three on the board, two on the bench. Who would I be looking for? I could, you know, it could be another mage. There's another evil knight. There's a wizard that we're probably going to need at some point. I could I could roll here. I could star some people up. I have a chance of starring up Argali or evil knight. I am on a streak. Let's see who I find. Argali knight. There we go. This is just one of those rounds where everything seems to be going my way, you know? That's really nice. With a two-star Golly Knight, if one more of these knights or humans, you know, were starred, I could switch in the rest of my humans here and start benefiting from the more uh, books of experience, which would be great because it gets us to a higher level faster. I could sell Venom for now. It's going to be a little while before I get my dragons in there. Okay, let's see. Nobody I need currently. Let's do a roll. Evil Knight. Source. Ugh, it's tough because all those mechs are two-starred. Ugh. Uh, I don't think I put my humans in yet. I don't. Maybe after this creep round. Or, excuse me, for the creep round. I think I can do it with just two two stars and then both of them being knights. That'll probably win me the round. If it doesn't, what a huge mistake that would be. But I feel like you got to take the books of experience at that point. Okay. Let's take these guys out of here. We're losing our max. Well, I guess I didn't need to lose them all. <laughs> I could have kept one of my two-star units. <laughs> Good move, Jake. Um, okay. And I'm going to put these items on our, our golly knight. All right, let's see here. We should win this encounter. I don't anticipate it being a problem with what we got here. We got a pretty good setup. And I'm really looking for items for our Dragon Knight now. Wooden Club could be used for Dragon Knight. Broken Sword. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for was this Broken Sword here. And every book of experience I get, I'm just using. So, I'm going to take this here, make a Black Ice Lance. For now, that can hang out on our Golly Knight just because he's two-star. But as soon as Dragon Knight becomes two-star, I'm going to move move this over. Okay, Grim Touch and Venom. Grim Touch is definitely part of our build, so is Venom. These are our little dragon buddies. And for now... Just have the game adjust our position. That's fine with me. 
I could level here and put one more unit out. I'm just thinking, who would I want that to be, really? The answer would be Venom. I'll just put him out there. Uh, actually, Argali Knight. Excuse me, Avenge Knight. He'll benefit from the Knight synergy. And Venom doesn't trigger the dragon, so I'll just have one more unit out there that benefits from our four-cost uh, Knight synergy, our four-person Knight synergy. Get those books of experience. I'm going to continue to just use them until I at least get to level nine. Pirate Captain is good. Werewolf. I can grab these people. I could see Pirate Captain being out there instead of Werewolf right now. Let's see. I feel like my throat's a little scratchy. I need some more water. Uh, I, I'm going to need to star some people up here soon. But I'd like to be a slightly higher level. So that I can find everyone I need. The mages, I think I'm going to let them go. I'm, I kind of want to do this build just with knights. Because I think it's more unusual to do that. It's not as good. The better build is using your five dragon synergy to power up your mages and your wizards. That's the better situation, but... You know, we want to have some fun too, right? I can put out you. I could swap. I could swap like you for you, and that gives me three warrior here. All right, let's see. We got 44 gold. Jeez. Okay. Let's see. I think we're okay for a moment. I'm most people we're gonna beat here but oh this is the other person win streaking so this could be our downfall let's see ah we handled it we handled it oh oh maybe we didn't maybe they're our golly knight's gonna take us actually no no we got it you say that big burst of magic scared me you guys heard me get scared, right? I was freaking out. I was shivering my timbers. All right. Let's see. Umbra's a dragon. I could have three dragon right now. To take that, I'd remove Doom. Maybe I do. Maybe I just go three dragon right now for fun. Why not? All right, I'm going to level. Put three dragons out there. Remove you, Doom. Sorry, buddy. You're probably a better unit. But I want my dragons to do dragon things. One more dragon and I can put our wizards out there and activate our five dragon synergy. It's unlikely I'll find five natural dragons. I mean, Frostblaze dragon also is terrible, as you all know. So I don't want him on the board, but you know, if he's there, he's there. I'm level nine now, so I don't need to use these books of experience. I can save gold and I can level there through gold. A lot of times I see people not use their books of experience here because it takes a lot and it's kind of better to use them to push to level 11 and 12. Need reinforcements? That's just my opinion. That's one man's opinion. Um, let's roll. Hell Knight, Lightblade Knight. I could get two more knights out there at some point. Hell Knight's a definite possibility. I don't think I need Lightblade Knight, right? Because if I use Wizards, I don't need Lightblade Knight. Grim Touch. Frost Knight also is decent. Ooh, we're actually having some trouble against this Kira. <clears throat> Take that, Kira. Dracula Mask I don't love. I don't love a lot of this. I might even actually take this Resistance Cloak. Um, Let's see. I can level. I can also roll a little. A lot of these people need to be starred up. I feel like I need to roll a bit. There's Dragon Knight. I'm going to get rid of you. Evil, we already start up. 
There's another dragon. Okay. Who would I want to pull? I'll pull a knight for a second. All right, I can get my dragons out there. I kind of like to have my experience. I kind of like to ride with six human long enough to get all of our experience, though. Can I do six human, five dragon? I don't think so with the wizards, could I? Let me think. Maybe I could if I actually went to level 10, huh? There's Umbra. Okay, let's see. If I pull one human... If I, I'd have to pull more humans, I think, than I can. What's the math of it? If I have two wizards out here... And... One more dragon... What do I, I have to pull two more units? So I can't do it yet, can I? I don't think so. Hmm. I can do it if I go to level 10, right? Doing the math too slow. Doing it too slow in my head. Let's just go to level 10. We got a lot of gold. Okay. Ooh, and we have items I didn't equip. This win streak is brutal right now. And yeah, we're just... I could put Tortola Elder out there. At this point, I'm going to use one of these. I don't even care. I don't want to do that. Dragon. I've got my four dragons. I pull you, and I pull you. That gives me five human. Hmm. I do lose it with that, don't I? Oh, but I need, I'll, I'll use my books of experience next round. Okay. So this does give me five dragon, which means all those units to the left uh, were able to cast, but this setup wasn't particularly good, and it looks like it got us killed. That's not a big deal. It's a bummer to lose the win streak, but... We're working on bigger things than <laughs> this whole winning thing, man. Some people don't get it, but it's not about winning, okay? All right, now I can get my six human out there. Who do I need? Is it werewolf? Who's gonna, one, two, three, four, five, six. These six get mana, is that right? I believe so. Let's give some more power to our golly knight here. Give a little to Dragon Knight as well. The mask to him. Okay. Here we go. Strange Egg. I'm going to Strange Egg our Dragon Knight here in just one second. And then I'm going to move my items over from Argali Knight to Dragon Knight. Six humans going to go away. And we're going to move to Dragons and Knights here very soon. But I just need them to get me the books of experience to push me to level 12. Okay. Ooh, got a thunder. Ooh, that feels dope. All right, let's see. I want this on Dragon Knight. I want this on Dragon Knight. I want... I could go either way with this. I'll wait one round here to see if they give me an ability to make this item with a life crystal as well. I kind of would like to make this item that I never remember the name of, Oblivion Staff. Oops, it made me move my Arcali Knight. God, these controls. Let's see what we can get here. A wooden club and, huh. I could teleport dagger, but there's no point. All right. What do we got on you? I will make one of ugh, one of these. Okay. All right, everything's equipped. The way I want it, you, instead of you. That was a mistake. Let's roll a little. Let's see what we get here. All right.
I'd really like to get, of course, the Black Ice Lance on our Dragon Knight here. He's the one. Here we are at level 12. I want to put Source out there, probably. I like Source. But we'll see. We gotta get our knights out there now. Let's see. Ooh, Rogue Guard. Mm. I want my knights. Tortola is very good. He's better than what I have out there, but I simply don't care. Evil Knight. So we got five of six knights. I gotta get one more knight on the board. One more knight. I'm gonna do five knights, six dragons. That's my plan. It's actually going pretty well. This is what happens. It takes you forever to find a match, and then you find a match, and you're kind of crushing it. Because I think I'm probably playing weak people. And that's what I would guess, is they're, they're not like... Yeah. Frostblaze Dragon. So I can do this without wizards right now. I don't even know if I want it. I mean, do I even need to? Hemlock. Hmm. Thunder Spirit. Scryer. We can put Lightblade Knight out there. I could do this without wizards, and I could put out, you know, like some legendary units like Scryer. Yeah, why not? I'll do it. I also could get Soul Reaper out there at some point, but maybe I'll just put out some legendary units for fun. Look at all these items. Look at all this. This is craziness. Okay. I'll put you out there instead of you. I know that Grim Touch combos well with Venom and all that, but... Oh, but we lose knights. Mm, we lose knights. I gotta find another knight. Hold on. Frost Knight. Alright, let's see. I've got five dragons and six knights. Who else can I pull out of there? Werewolf's still in there, right? Oh, I gotta put these items on people, too. <laughs> We don't have anything going on right. This is a mess. This is such a mess. Okay. Here we go. Werewolf's still in there. I'm going to get rid of where I want to get rid of both of these chuckleheads. Pirate Captain and Werewolf. I don't care about either of them. I want Scryer in there. And who else? I guess maybe Grim Touch, huh? Okay. Hell Knight. We don't need you anymore, buddy, but we can use you instead of Light Blade Knight. And now I gotta move these items around because look at this mess. <laughs> look at all these items. This is crazy, Jake. Uh, yeah. Black Ice Lance. All right. Let's go. Let's just start doing things because we got to do them. Put that on you. I'll put some magic crystals on you. You don't have any room, right? No. Make one of these. No, stop moving my units. Okay. God, it takes so long to just put things on people. I have some more things to make, huh? Make some life crystals. Well, that was intense. That happened fast. I gotta move a lot faster if I wanna make this happen. I'm gonna chop you up and cook you for dinner. Cannon Granny. Yes, please. Ross plays dragon. Mm. 
Umbra. Okay, what do we got going on here? <laughs> I should put, I should definitely put Cannon Granny over to take advantage of that big mana situation in the beginning. That's for sure. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, you you six get mana. Everyone else can screw. Everyone else can screw. Grim touch again. Scryer. Let's just roll it down. It's all gonna be done soon, right? I'll two star my cannon granny. Go for it, cannon granny. Start off two star and start shooting everybody like crazy. Got some unequipped items here. Who needs some health? Who's dying too fast? Maybe Scryer. It's like, I'm frontlining my Scryer. Oh, this is great. <laughs> Just making me laugh. Let's see what else we're gonna do here. I don't even know, honestly, I couldn't tell you who's on my bench right now. I know I grabbed some Dragon Knights at one point, hoping to three star him. Who do I got? I got Dragon Knights, Scryer, Grand Herald can go. Okay. That Zeus damage is pretty good. It's hitting us pretty hard. Ooh, is that it? Did we take him? Close. Pretty close. Dragonite again. There's a possibility Dragonite goes three star in this. There's also a possibility we get a two star Scryer and a two star Frostblaze Dragon. I think these are all the people I want getting my uh, mana, right? I mean, I can combine that, sure. What other item do I want? That frosty armor, probably. Cool seeing Cannon Granny do all that damage. Okay, yeah, I'll take the frosty armor. Thank you. One of those for sure. Okay. Let's see what we find. Anybody. Anybody. Strange egg. Hmm. All right. I'll strange egg Scryer. I wanted to do it with Dragon Knight, but it's happening with Scryer. A two-star Scryer, as it were. Doing their thing. And what a match! What a game! Dragons and knights. That was a that was a chaotic experience for me. I felt I felt like I was in a rave most of that time. But I hope you enjoyed it. It just felt like a lot. Like lights and sounds, tons of units, too much going on, too much for one cowboy to handle. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for listening. I hope you liked it. I'll see you all next time. Mwah.